UFC lightweight division belt. So here we go with the start of round one. I can tell how excited you are for this matchup. Seems to be a striking advantage on one side, but maybe not. This is a big time fight. It feels like a big moment for both of these guys' careers. Who is gonna be able to implement their game plan the best in this matchup between these two big time athletes? Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively, protecting his... Whoa! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, he might be out. So both guys landing at will here. Good action early. Well, a lot of people think he might have the best jab in this division, certainly using it effectively here. I mean, one of the best jabs in the world across all combat sports. The way that it just comes out, it's, oh, man, look at that. Picture perfect. Got to the leg, got to his position, got another beautiful takedown. Looks like his leg is hurt here. You can even see him limping a little bit. Trying to hammer that lead leg. Just out of range with that strike. Keep your hands up. Use your footwork now. Oh, spinning back fist. That punch, no good. The right hook to the body. Throwing that jab yet again out of range. securing these takedowns. Well, he works hard to get up again here, but he looks hooked. Good punch lands. Oh, nice. Nice. Well, the leg kicks have been a big storyline in this one, and there's another one. So he continues to slow his opponent down, and nice poker face on the other side. I'm not sure how many more he's take. He won't be able to take many more. Think about Edson Barbosa, how he lands those beautiful leg kicks, no wind-up so fast. Eventually, guys get stopped from taking too many. This seems to be the path that he is wanting to take tonight in this fight. Well, he continues to stay busy. What do they say, DC? Punches and punches? Punches and punches. He landed him upside of the opponent's head over and over again. Five minutes in the books. strike to the body really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds right to the target let's see if his opponent can survive i cannot believe he is still standing after taking that point throws a big right hand but doesn't find its home Ooh, big shot man Leg kick. Missed with that right hand. Come on, buddy. Keep your hands up. Let's go. Slips that left hand. Clipped him with the right hand there. How about that chin? Wow. Actually got the takedown. And he gets the single leg takedown. Now connects with the right. All right, so inside the open guard of his opponent. You gotta be careful playing around for too long here on the ground with this guy. Man, as he landed a high volume of strikes here in round, round two, definitely picking up the pace out. This one appeared to stun him. He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Trying to 
kick the leg out. Oh, look at that jab. Snapped his head back. His jab gets to the target so fast, and he always brings his hands right back to his face. Big call for punch land. Now he gets back to range. Well, not much of a setup there. Misses with the left hook. Oh, nice. Missed with that attempt. Worked hard for that single leg takedown. No good. He changes the angle, finds the right spot to land that punch to the head from the clinch. Oh, that's a nice strike. Took has been there at times, not that time. Nice defense there, huge block. Throwing that jab, no good. Oh, buckled him there, beautiful shot to the body. Oh, he lands a straight punch there, DC. We'll see if he can follow it up now. He has been throwing the strike over and over again. Look how crisp and straight he is. And he lands a punch there. Pretty good connection by him. Great connection. He's in a great flow right now. All right, round three coming up next. All right, the round is over. Gut check time for him now. You see the cut on his cheek has gotten really, really bad. And even though it's not affecting his vision, if it gets any worse, the doctor will be called in. And I can assure you. You ready? You ready? And we are back for our third and final round. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Just misses there with the left. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. And he landed the right hand there. Just out of range with that left hook. Slips the shot. Quite find that range. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Wow. What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Don't finish his fight. All right, so you got to be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't want to mess around for too long. All right, got to be careful playing around inside his guard. Absolutely, John. That's why you don't sit in a full guard. When you sit in the full guard, it gives these guys too many opportunities to chase submissions. And now he's jumping on a triangle. Oh, man. This ground and pound is good. Probably my favorite striking realm in MMA, and he's as good as it gets. The problem is his opponent is not controlling his posture. He's allowing his opponent to get up, and when he does, he creates this space to land these beautiful ground and pound combinations. All right, he's trying to control posture here. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. Oh, nice job to reverse position on the ground. It was bad, but now it's not so bad. What a fantastic sweep. Back to the feet. Feet now, feet now. Oh, he's got it going in there, DC. Another punch landing. And everything's landing with so much power. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh, and that is it. Referee has seen enough, and maybe so have we. Your winner by TKO. That was a great performance. Way to land those strikes and go and chase down the finish when you get an opportunity. the octagon for the official decision to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, four seconds.